So how can you tell whether to trust a news story about emotion or not? One clue is whether the story talks about parts of the brain as if they have dedicated functions, like this is where fear lives and over here is where happiness lives. This is simply the wrong approach, whether we're talking about a human or an earthworm. Here's another clue. If the story implies that parts of your brain are off until they're suddenly turned on, then you know you should be suspicious. This old idea that you only use 10% of your brain is really for science fiction stories and cartoons. No part of your brain is ever truly off. Your whole brain works all the time, but different neurons are more or less active. They pass more or less information to one another at different times, making different brain patterns.